This is a prologue to the campaign of the heir to the throne. In the 28th year of the region of Garald II, King of Esnot, the kingdom was plundered into a bitter war with the orcs of the north. The northern host encamped at Cal Galcadar by the fort of Abes, and the king led his forces to meet them. Splitting his army in two, he led one half, while his son, the crown prince Eldred, led the other. Eldred was a brave and courageous warrior, able to lead his soldiers well. Unfortunately for Garhart, his son was also ambitious and treacherous. In the heat of battle, Eldred's men turned on the king, and so Garhart was slain in battle that day. Along with his brother and his sons and all his sons but Eldred. Garard's queen, Ashaveir, looked on with glee, having come to watch the battle from a nearby hill. The rule of her son would satisfy her lust for power far better than her husband's head. In exchange for tribute, the war, war, warlord of the north happily made peace with Eldred, who proclaimed himself king and led his army south towards Weldin. But Garard Archmage Delphador has escaped the battle and riding with haste reached Weldin first. He mustered a force of loyalists to fight Eldred and avenge the king's death. The loyalist army marched north to meet Eldred. Eldred made war upon Delphador and his forces with his mother's advice ringing in his ears. Fight no one greater or smaller except the old mage whose head should be severed from his shoulders. Severed from his shoulders. And Eldred did in indeed meet Delphador face to face in battle, in the heightened lands near Tart. Sword clashed against the staff, and the wise old mage Fall fought a brash young warrior. In the end, Delphador's men were defeated and routed, but Ashabeir found her son's lifeless body fixed to the ground by the great mage's staff. Ashabeir herself then took command of the army and led it back to the Veldin, knowing that the king's young siblings were next in line to the throne. She ordered them all to be killed and declared herself the Queen of Vesnot. Soon after news of Ashever's orders reached the Delphador, he secretly entered the palace and stole, stole away Conrad the youngest of Garald's new halves, thereby saving him from death. Fleeing to Aetherwood beyond the southwest border of Vesnot, Delphador raised the child Conrad under the protection of the elves, watching sadly as Ashaver's region of terror over land has begun. End of prologue.